And we're underway. Muse will not try to run it out. Play action pass. Beck was looking deep. Throws it deep. Rosemary Jackson has the touchdown. Is not a slow start. This is the way you do it. You see Kentucky selling out against the run. Zion Childress sprints towards the line of scrimmage. To Kentucky after a season back with the Los Angeles Rams. Plenty of time for Leary. And the catch by Tavion Robinson. 100 miles an hour. And Tavion Robinson's a guy in this offense that really needs to start to come on. He's excellent after the catch. They Carson Beck, four for four. And comes out firing again. Still perfect. First down. Ra Ra Thomas, the catch. Under three minutes to go. At Auburn last week. Beck over the middle. Oscar Delp, the number two tight end. Three straight touchdown drives for the come from behind win. Faked it to Edwards. Man wide open. It's Bowers taken down inside the 40. You can tell, obviously, Kirby Smart trusts his quarterback. You have short yard situation. Kentucky completely selling out again. Todd Munkin, who left after last season to be the offensive coordinator for the Baltimore Ravens. Back wide open in the flat. Edwards. Edwards dives down. Looked to be just a little bit short of the 10 for 10 for 131. They're averaging more than 10 yards per play on their first two possessions to the end zone and it is incomplete Really close a great job by Thomas high pointing it. But look at that left foot Looks like that foot actually lands in bounds as he was going to the ground. Take a look at that left foot I agree secures the catch looks like that left foot is down might want to take another look at this yeah, there's the left foot. They are going to stop it. The ruling on the field of an incomplete pass is under video review. And that left foot's down first before the right foot comes down out of bounds. Receiver in a big miss. Second and seven. Looking deep again. Another wide open receiver caught this time by Dane Key. And into Georgia territory again. Take some shots, and they are. And this is a great route. Kind of fakes the post to the inside. Just a deep V route. And Key. Going with quick tempo. Third down and five. Movement along the line. Looks like it's going against Kentucky. And the ball is caught by Rosemary Jackson. By Carson Beck. Seeing that the defender had jumped off sides. Knowing he has a one-on-one -on -one shot down the left sideline, free play, take a chance. And Rosemary Jackson, their strongest receiver. Last week at Auburn, we're on third down and good for first down conversions. Very important player on third down. Wide open, Oscar Delp for the Georgia touchdown. Last week at Auburn, we're on third down and good for first down conversions. Very important player on third down. Wide open, Oscar Delp for the Georgia touchdown. And you're going to see, obviously, a full sell by Kentucky against the run. A similar play that they hit Brock Bowers on earlier. averaging 5.7 yards per play. And the line is protecting Larry well. He's on target again for a first down to midfield to Dane Key. Off the play fake. Leary, corner to the end zone. And it is caught by Josh Caddis for a Kentucky touchdown. Enormous answer for Kentucky. They go with a little 321 loop pass right. Loop that quarterback out. Designed to throw it in the flat. You almost never throw it to the corner. But in this case, Leary likes the matchup. He sees the defender. Malachi Starks' back is to him. So he can... 
Three possessions, three drives, 75, 82, and 95. And here they come again. Brock Bowers. How did he get so wide open? And this one goes for 59. Yeah, just a complete bust in the secondary there by Kentucky. Brock Bowers, as a result, very traditional alignment. It's not like they hit him. He is wide open. Time out on the field for a player injury. And as you can see, him after the catch, man, he makes the first defender miss more. Last year, Beck is the holder. And that 36-yarder is good. So Woodring is 7 out of 10 now in field goals. They just did get it off. And he's under the rest and buried. Back at the 25. Javon Dumas Johnson. And Georgia not in any hurry. Takes the clock all the way down. A low snap and a touchdown. Kendall Milton. And it's 30 to 7, Georgia. And just a great job here by the right side of the offensive line. As you can see on the right side, Xavier Trust just securing the edge and kind of hooking the defender. That looked like the form of a young man who was the number one high school kicker in the country last year. Just a three-man rush for Kentucky. In the traffic, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Maxwell Hairston. And with some running room along the near sideline. And chopped down by Beck. Inside the 30. Interception of the year for Hairston. And it's just not a good decision for Carson Beck. A play that they ran earlier in the game that resulted in a touchdown to Rosenby Jack State. That was the first touchdown of the game. This time he's trying to force it to love it on the over route. Throws it a little bit too high. It was well covered. The fact that Leary was the quarterback was another reason why he wanted to come back to Kentucky. Wide open Davis. First down inside the 10. Touchdown Kentucky. Fourth receiving touchdown of the season. He can hurt you in the pass game as well. And a great job, too, by Devin Leary. As you see those two Georgia defenders that are approaching, he has to kind of navigate between two defenders to make that throw. But they're lined up. Davis, the running back on the right hip of Leary. They direct snap it to Davis. Trying to surge toward the end zone. He got stacked up well short. The only tight end in the top 10 in the voting since 1977, Ken McAfee. It's supposed to go to the best player in college football. A lot of great players. 69 straight sellouts, and they love it. Jamon Dumas Johnson with his second sack. And his first Georgia touchdown. Powers is wide open. Touchdown. 21 yards, his first touchdown reception of the night. He also does a watch along on, uh, I believe, on YouTube. So people are watching the game with Coach Donovan and getting his insights. Jalen Walker in on the sack. There's a sophomore from Salisbury, North Carolina. His dad was his uh, high school coach, Curtis, the former defensive coordinator in college at Coastal Carolina. Flags down. Muse electrifying those who are still between the hedges and in the stands. And back here in Athens, Brock Vandegrift on for his second series. Hands it off to Cash Jones, the former walk-on. He got chopped down shy of the 30 by Zion Childress. Vandegrift. Fire showing off his arm on target. To the 20-yard line to Pierce Sperlin. Real big question mark right now. I'm just not really sure how to feel about them at the moment. Vandergriff wants Lucky to pluck for him. He got shot down right at the fourth and goal. They're going for it from the eight. Vandergriff's four out of six for 39 since coming in for Beck. Andrew Paul to the pylon, touchdown! 
JQ Hardaway couldn't stop him. And Georgia's put up 50 tonight against a usually very stout Kentucky defense.